Najib Razak's SRC International Corruption Trial reaches its climax this morning when a five-member federal court bench led by Chief Justice Tengku Maimun Tuan Mat sits to hear the former Prime Minister's final appeal against his conviction and sentence by the Kuala Lumpur High Court handed down two years ago. The appeal is scheduled for this morning after the same panel heard and dismissed Najib's motion for leave to adduce fresh evidence in an attempt to show that Judge Nazlan Ghazali should not have presided over the trial due to a conflict of interests. It is set to run until August 26th. Upon dismissal of the motion on Tuesday, Najib's lead counsel Hisham Tepote sought an adjournment of the appeal. He said Najib's newly assembled defence team appointed on July 25th would require more time to prepare for the hearing. The application was refused by the Apex Court. It is believed that the defence team may include another plea for an adjournment to be made this morning. On July 28, 2020, Najib was convicted on all charges and sentenced to 12 years imprisonment and a fine of 210 million ringgit, which was upheld by the Court of Appeal on December 8 last year. If his conviction and sentence are upheld by the federal court, Najib will be made to immediately serve his jail sentence and will automatically lose his long-held parliamentary seat in Pekan.